Construction projects worldwide are infamous for their endless delays and under-budgeting, whether they've been unbelievably abandoned or are seemingly ongoing. Here are 10 grand projects that, at one time or another, slightly more than they could chew. Ten, the Big Dig Boston. Boston's Central Artery Tunnel Project, also known as the Big Dig, is one of the U.S.'s most infamous construction projects. A 3.5-mile tunnel to divert the city's interstate incurred design flaws, planning overruns, and unexpected barriers such as buried houses and the construction bones of once sunken ships. Construction crews also had to work around operating subway tunnels without disturbing rail service. By the time of the CAT's finish in December 2007, it had become America's most expensive highway project, surpassing its original completion date by nine years. It cost an enormous $14.6 billion, $22 billion including interest. The project included excavating 16 million cubic yards of dirt and used 3.8 million cubic yards of concrete. It also took 16 years. 9. San Francisco-Oakland Bay Bridge, California it took a horrible magnitude 6.9 earthquake and a fragmentary collapse of the Oakland-San Francisco-Oakland Bay Bridge's eastern span to prove to Bay Area officials they needed something that could withstand a big quake. The 1989 Loma Prieta earthquake put into motion the construction of a new self-anchored suspension bridge, one that would ultimately surpass its initial $1.1 billion budget by more than $5 million and take five years longer to construct than planned. After building the 2,040-foot span began in 2002, welding problems, political debates over its design, and dozens of bolts failures to adjust portions of the bridge deck to concrete columns plagued its construction. Ultimately, the Bay Bridge's new eastern span opened for traffic on September 3, 2013. Fortunately, it's designed to withstand significant earthquakes for the next 1,500 years. 8. Sagrada Familia Barcelona, Spain Barcelona's Sagrada Familia is undoubtedly one of the world's most drawn-out modern construction projects. Construction of the still-unfinished Gothic and Art Nouveau-style church commenced in 1882. Catalan architect Antoni Gaudi took over its design in 1883. When he passed away in 1926, only a quarter of the project was finished. Gaudi once said that this was partly because of his client not being in much of a hurry. Although construction paused briefly during the Spanish Civil War, during which time parts of the basilica were broken, this Roman Catholic church is now more than 50% finished. The structure will hopefully be completed around 2026. If that finally happens, it will have 18 spires with a 520-foot spiral over the basilica's dome, making it the world's tallest church. 7. Second Avenue Subway, New York New York City's 2nd Avenue subway became a bane in Gotham's side since 1929, when the idea for a rapid transit line below 2nd Avenue first came to fruition. Often called the line that time forgot, it has incurred a series of starts and stops. This is primarily due to low funds and construction issues, such as the delayed delivery of a tunnel boring machine for nearly a century. If ever finished, the 2nd Avenue subway will take 8.5 miles from 125th Street in Harlem South to Hanover Square's New York Financial District. Construction is continuing, but only a two-mile stretch and three subway stations are complete and opened in 2017. Funding the remainder cost $17 billion. 6. The Channel, the United Kingdom, France. The 31.4-mile, commonly undersea channel tunnel connecting the UK and France opened in 1994 after a relatively short construction period, only six years. But it took so much longer to get the project rolling. Ideas for a cross-channel fixed link were first recorded in 1802. Despite the efficiency of construction, the channel cost a total of $7.48 billion upon completion, a whopping 80% over its estimated budget. And since opening, it has been plagued with different problems. Several fires have led to its temporary shutdown. Many train failures have led to Eurostar passengers being stuck underground for hours. However, in terms of mechanical advancements, the channel is recognized as the first mainline rail tunnel to have special cooling equipment, including chilled water circulating through pipes from either side of the underground passage. 5. Sydney Opera House, Sydney, Australia It's one of the world's most famous buildings, although the Sydney Opera House was a total headache to build. After selecting Danish architect John Utzon's extraordinary design, the Australian government pushed for an early beginning of construction fearing possible public backlash. 
Sadly, Utsan was still working on his final designs, which led to significant problems later, including rebuilding the structure's roof supporting central podium columns. Bad weather and other unexpected woes slowed construction almost immediately. Then, in 1966, a conflict between Utsan and Australia's new government headed to the architect's resignation. He left the country with his family and left behind an incomplete shell. A team of contemporary architects eventually completed the Opera House. It officially opened in 1973, 10 years after its original completion date, and at the cost of $102 million, more than 14 times the original budget. Despite the problems, the Sydney Opera House exhibits several impressive engineering feats. It's one of the first construction designs worldwide to use Araldite, a synthetic resin adhesive for bonding metals, in its structure, and was one of the pioneer's uses of digital structural analysis. 4. Watts Bar Nuclear Power Plant, East Tennessee This construction began in 1973. The first of its two nuclear reactors, a Westinghouse pressurized water reactor, began operating in 1996. Reactor 2 was nearly 80% finished in 1988 when the TVA decided to halt construction based on reduced demand for the electricity it was slated to generate. Growing demand for energy caused the TVA to resume construction in 2007, finishing Reactor 2 in 2016. Of course, safety issues, including relocating some of the reactor's systems above floodlines, led to delays. Costs for the reactor have almost doubled since the initial estimate of $2.5 billion. The total cost of the project was $12 billion. 3. American Dream Meadowlands, East Rutherford, New Jersey American Dream Meadowlands is a delayed retail and entertainment complex, complete with an indoor water park and indoor snow park in New Jersey Meadowlands Sports Complex, originally slated to open in 2007. The Mills Corporation proposed the project in 2003 and broke ground in 2004 before going bankrupt in 2007. Colonial Captain then took the reins, but construction stopped in May 2009 after the global financial firm Lehman Brothers Holdings went bankrupt and quit making payments. In February 2011, a massive snowstorm damaged the abandoned structure, causing the buckling of a wall and a partial roof collapse, following in the need for additional construction. Adding insult to injury, a lawsuit from the neighboring New York Giants and New York Jets above traffic concerns has led to even more delays. The Triple Five Group has taken control of the project, and despite the pending lawsuit, finished the project in 2019. 2. World Islands, Dubai United Arab Emirates Dubai is known for extravagant, incredible, but often unfinished design projects. So it's no surprise that the world, an artificial archipelago of more than 300 man-made islands, distinct from the Emirates' Persian Gulf Coast, is still awaiting its residents. Dubai ruler Sheikh Mohammed originally conceived of and unveiled the idea in 2003, estimating an overall cost of $14 billion. Shoveling began almost immediately. By 2008, the archipelago was finished, and more than 60% of the islands were sold. Still, real estate efforts stalled with the coming of the global economic crisis. The islands were left totally undeveloped, save for a show house and the Royal Island Beach Club, presented on Lebanon Island in 2012. There's even been consideration that the islands are sinking back into the sea. 1. Esperanza Site, Asbury Park, New Jersey for more than 20 years, the corner of Asbury Park's 4th and Ocean Avenues has worked as a constant reminder of the city's apparently infinite financial hardships. First, it held the steel skeleton of a never-completed 224-unit apartment high-rise. This huge eyesore stood rusting by the boardwalk for 17 years. Hoboken-based Metro Homes took over the land in 2006. They destroyed the structure, beginning work from the ground up on the Esperanza. This luxury condo development was slated to breathe new life into the city. That is, before the real estate bubble burst in 2007, Metro Homes suspended all construction. Ever since, the lot has been home to nada but a concrete foundation and some huge rebar beams. There's a Facebook page commanding for its demolition.